Today's episode of the Saturday Sunday Hit Anime Show comes courtesy of Crunchyroll Funimation. Watch Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid along with us in sub via Crunchyroll, with no subscription required. If you'd prefer the dub, you'll need a subscription to Funimation Premium for legal streaming. Also, check out Juby Phonics' amazing cover of Miss Kobayashi's first opening, Azora No Rhapsody. Links to everything in the description below. Now, on to the show! Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Saturday Sunday Hit Anime Show. I am your anime host, Older Bro. I'm your other anime host, Younger Bro. And today it's time for the Beach episode, the always required episode in all anime, even Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. And the first clip I ever watched of Miss Kobayashi's yep. Dragon Maid. Yep. Yep. Can't imagine. I don't so know where aggressive. to look. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, I'm flat. They didn't even change that line. It's exactly the same. Yeah. No, no need for changes for that. Just yeah, you have way too little clothing on right now. You're gonna need to come with me. Yeah, I love the audio outtake. Yeah, but I'm always naked. Yeah, I'm all yeah, <laughs> which is technically true. <laughs> yeah, we uh, uh, like we said in previous episode, guys, we are now watching this on a DVD. So uh, we are we watched the like in order to get to the next episode and record properly, we have to watch a yeah. little bit of the last yeah. episode. Yeah, so we see the, the very audio end clip. outros. Yeah, the yeah the outro. Uh, or, well the the coming the next time. So, ne yeah, the next, next time, time on Dragon Ball Z, <laughs> next time on Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Ma Maid, I'm always naked. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. There's, yeah. just, there's no context. They need they they just saw the context. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't need any context. Nope, they didn't. <laughs> but they have it anyways, as is required. Here's all of our Here's the other models. context. <laughs> Uh, I'm a kid, you're a full-grown woman. <laughs> Get away from me. I mean, is it really any better if uh, it was a kid and another kid? She could probably make herself into a kid if she wanted. Yeah. I mean, what I'm saying is, is there any? Is there really any difference between Kana and Saikawa and Shota and uh, Lukwa? <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't need an extra swimsuit. Even though I'm a goddess, not a dragon. Abs. <laughs> <laughs> I love that yeah. line. Relax. I don't like the beach. Thank you. <laughs> that's gotta be star wars no uh, like sand getting everywhere is better it is like not a reference necessarily to have fun i can't imagine literally she's here because her boss said hey uh look after it's a cinderay thing <laughs> yeah yeah please go with my son also make sure that his um Nanny uh, stays out of trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, Luca was like, get as weird as you want. Nine. Ha <laughs> ha <laughs> I like how I wanted her to yeah. rub it on her breasts and just. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that would definitely get this out of PG thirteen. <laughs> this time I actually wasn't doing anything. You know what that is? <laughs> 
I don't know how I could be act so act like I'm currently acting right now. Exactly the same. No changes. Oh, I love this. Hiya. Yeah. <laughs> Her yay is just as cute as Fluttershy's. Yep. I'm dangerous. Existed. <laughs> you can breathe underwater. What? Probably. <laughs> Oh, God. Human standards, please. She didn't think this through. Nope, <laughs> she did not think of that. <laughs> I win. <laughs> I'll kick your Human asses. standards. I can't wait till the government shows up on our doorstep and you can may mail them away. Please don't attack the government. Chibi Kobayashi. Oh, you have a mouth as a father, too. Kill family, fucking hell. Yeah, kill family. Kill fathers? It's kind of important to know about my wife's family. No. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell's that mean? Except I was total Liz. But they died of cancer. <laughs> no, she actually has parents. She's just an adult. Yeah. Unlike most animes where they're teenagers, this I person's know. like, yeah, I don't see my family that often because I'm an adult and live on my own and they live on their own. <laughs> like... Because they are afraid of what is different. Yeah, Miss Kobayashi is just... Hum Miss Kobayashi. Who the hell is saying that? Oh, it's her father. Yes. No, dumbass. I, I refuse. I mean, dragons are warm-blooded. They're cold-blooded, so obviously they're going to get listless uh, when it's hot. I'm gonna need some context. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. A dun dun dun. Too fast. <laughs> Kana is just like, yeah, I've done this before. Yep, absolutely has. I am fishing off my girlfriend's back. I yeah, I would fish too. I haven't been fishing in three years. I mean, this has got to be international water, right? Yeah, my parents are dead. They were slain. Kinda. I don't think that'd work well. Chomp on the lobster now. Please chomp on them. <laughs> that sounds violent. Yes. <laughs> oh. 
I mean, you are literally Armageddon. You're not supposed to have common sense. You're hell flying on Earth. That's what you are. I can read your mind, Miss Kobayashi. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I've got some bait for you. Oh. <laughs> I thought she was going to chomp on some lobster. That's what they're doing. Throw out the crab, get a big, bigger <laughs> lobster. Wait. Sure, whatever. You're thousands of years old and you're not considered an adult? Nope. No. You've That's hooked deep. something. Wait, in the, <laughs> yeah, in the official, they don't even respond yeah. to that. It's just like, ah, oh, fuck, you've got a fish. Wow. That is depressing. <laughs> I have no eyes when I'm a dragon. I'm just listless. Yeah, I'm eyeless. I'm actually blind, did you know? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, but you've been seeing me up till now. Nah, I, I cast a spell to see your outline. What? Firework. This is going to be depressing. <laughs> that is the most accurate firework I've ever seen. Please, no. That is a better firework. Yes. Not, lot, not gonna lie. You've set the atmosphere on fire. It is raining. Hack, hack. Yeah. Also, stop burning up our atmosphere. Don't, we won't be able to breathe. Don't, yeah, don't talk and breathe fireworks at the same time. Oh, the lines, lines, it's lines! Yeah, th I'm pretty sure this was sponsored by the actual event called Comic Cat. <laughs> they collapsed from too much anime. <laughs> That's fair. That is 100% fair. See? Fair, fair. Oh, you. You look like cosplay. He's participating. Because he's a uh, fanboy now. I will get more treasure this way. He's not wrong. <laughs> what, are you jealous of me? And now you see the only thing that can motivate all human beings. An insatiable thirst. <laughs> no running in the halls. Oh, fuck that. You are not going to stop these people. They are thirsty. Desires. Thirsty as fuck. That looks like Miku. New and previous one. Yeah, this is this not only is actually how this works, they do actually have people to hold signs in the back of the line telling people where the end of the line for this one manga is. This yeah. is, like, I'm pretty I'm, sure very yeah, th realistic. This is realistic. I've seen it. Like, most of the cons we'd see would not be this big, but... Not by choice. That's because I'm blonde, isn't it? They always say that. There you go. Yeah. Never try to tell the uh, the cosplayers to get out of character. It doesn't work. Yeah, that is true. Like, it'd have to be rare circumstances for them to... Yeah, they basically only break character if someone is actually dying. 
Um, yeah. No. Thirst. What yeah. part of they're all thirsty do you not understand? I'm not sure if they're this packed every time. This is Comic Hat. This the reason it's this is sponsored. This is like one of the biggest uh, cons in all Japan. It's this packed. Damn. <laughs> like yes, by collecting. Yep. I love this episode because I have this clip. Yep. <laughs> now I hope the teacher's like, wait a wait minute, a did second. you eat a cicada? What like, the fuck's wrong with you? Other cultures eat bugs all the time. I don't see a problem. That's it, you're going to child services. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is not a problem. No yeah, one's yeah. in his line. <laughs> Guess what you think's it's in this free. book? Is it? Yeah, I know. I've seen this clip too. Yeah, legit actual curses that people can actually really cast. You're charging a thousand yen for real curses! <laughs> hey, look, the cosplayers. Yep. No! That's not a maid, or correct at all. Nine. They aren't. Yeah, they're just legitimately actually a real witch, a real goblin, and a real whatever the hell that other thing is. Yep. Hey. <laughs> Probably, but I'm not. They are They're yeah. Drawn. For anyone who <laughs> Yep, that's very true. Why are you Why here? Why are you in that? Why is she here? Hey, look, it was the bunny creature that, that Kana got. Like, that's the... That's that creature's based on a real actual person. You could pretend to be an animatronic. Can I let my tail down? Why are you asking my permission? You're allowed you, to do what you, you want. Yeah. I don't care. You can do it. That took a Miss Kobayashi's seconds. dragon maid. Looks too real. The line for taking photos of Miss Kobayashi's dragon maid or starts right here. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Okay, I'm going to have to start charging people. They all just run away. Mm. 
You look dead inside. I like how he's at, she's asking this to a person who's clearly here for a reason. Yeah. <laughs> Don't start making out. <laughs> Are you about to grope that character? You better hold up a... PG-13 only, please. Yeah, there is a line. <laughs> There's about 20 lines around you now. Get used to it. Comic market. Yeah, Comic Cat 90 is over. I believe this is... I believe they would call this a market for doujin. It's specifically the term for fan-made like, manga and such. I'd like to go to conventions, but... No, I, it was fine. Yeah, every time I hear about a convention, just... They didn't. They didn't. Everyone is thirsty. Yeah, I wish... Hell no, I'm done with this. <laughs> and thus the cycle continues as they now write Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. Yeah, what, what is the studio called again? <laughs> uh, oh, the one who made Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid? Uh, that would be right here. Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. Blu-ray. It doesn't even say on it. No, it, it doesn't say. It just says Funimation. I'm sorry. I, I know it has something to do with those three characters. I'm so sad. It doesn't even list them on here. Goddamn Kyoto Animation. Kyoto Animation is the name of the studio. Okay. So no, it has nothing to do with those characters. What? But it's not even on the DVD. I swear those three characters are a reference to something. I know. I, I know you've told me. Maybe, but they're not. Yeah, you know, but it's not. I I'm just actually angry. I don't even think it listed in the. Oh, there it is. Kyoto Animation in very, very, very tiny text. It's like the smallest text you could read on there. Yeah, like, it's, Michael, it's stop it. right Holy there. Holy fuck, it's so goddamn small. I'm not even joking. It's so tiny. Guys, it's like a pixel on a freaking printed cardboard box. It's like, yeah, there's definitely something about Kyoto Animation on here somewhere. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm reading with my contacts out. Hold on. Yeah. Uh, okay, guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. I'll have to get my magnifying glass for that. Yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. We're gonna come back next time with even more Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. Probably not at Comic Cat. Until then, we will see you all on the next Saturday, Sunday. Hit anime! Goodbye!